Oh boy. Oh boy, 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 oh boy. Oh boy. Welcome back everybody. I'm Insamniac and this is Selma and I'm really scared. <laughs> We're gonna I'm just gonna jump back in. I'm not ready for this, but it actually wasn't that bad, but the first session wasn't after a while. I kind of got used to it a little bit. But this Simon has found the wreck of the Curie, a large ship on the bottom of the sea, in the hopes it to find an emergency vessel and travel to the site called Theta. <laughs> Oh crap. Why did no this isn't fair. No. Yeah. I'm messed up, bro. You god. Is he gone? Anyway, what I was gonna say is that this encounter was particularly terrible. Ah! <laughs> Can I crouch? Okay. I don't know if it matters. It probably doesn't. He sounds like he's right next to me. Oh. Okay, that's a dead end. And that's... Is that a floating femur? Cool. Uh, um, okay. I don't know what I'm supposed to be doing here and hang on a second. I'm turning the game volume way the heck down. I actually should probably just do that in general. Okay, I can't, I can't adjust it individually, but well, okay. Is that a little more tolerable? I couldn't even really hear myself think. I don't know exactly what I need to do in this section. I'm gonna go ahead and close that. Because apparently I was looking right at it. Where, where is it? I'm just gonna hobble through these halls. I didn't know you could hobble underwater, but I'm doing a pretty good job of it. What was that? Can I throw that? I really, I seriously, sincerely do not know what the heck I'm supposed to do. <sighs> Break the glass, okay. All right, that's just playing on loop, which is fun. I don't, I don't, I don't know what to do. What, who, why? Can I trap him in the, ooh. Why are you over here now? I think I've been down this way though. Oh. Oh, there's stuff this way. Okay. Nope, that's a dead end. <sighs> okay. Supremely lost. I don't know where the finish line is supposed to be. Where the end of this maze is. But... I would very much like to get out of here. I don't hear it. Do I hear it? Is that... Is it just on the other side of this wall? Oh 
Okay. I'm going to pause for a moment. Something seems to be wrong here. Hmm. Nope. Why is it acting like stream isn't working? Okay. Oh, come on. Does it know where I'm at? Okay. Why is this door not closing? Lame. I think it's moving down the hall behind me, which I don't like. very much want to be on the ladder already. Just close that. No. Okay. Does this mean that I am safe for a moment? Or am I uh, pretending? What's up, Kieran? Um... Because I feel like I'm safe. For the moment. Uh, this looks somewhat promising. Do I have a flashlight? Oh, this is a... This is a thing. Huh? What? Oh, you made it. This is much better. Let's see if we can't get this thing moving. Uh, oh, wait, what? Safety locks are blocking the vessel's release. Are you kidding? How much more of an emergency could this ship be in? It's on the bottom of the sea. Take a look at the engine room and see if you can figure it out. Maybe there's an override or something. There's monsters out there, like the ones we saw at Lambda. The more reason to get going. What? Come on, you know the drill. Don't look at them or get too close. It'll mess with your circuits. Oh, shit. Oh. We need to get out of here. I know, I know, I'm going. Yeah, don't don't look at him or get too close or any, anything, actually. It seems like they can figure out where I'm at. Regardless. has a B ends with an O and has uh, I don't know okay what why who nope do I have a flashlight oh, there's just a random shirt in here that's actually Super creepy. I do have a flashlight. I forgot. Sort of. I remember forgot. Okay. Is 
some sort of kitchen with a bunch of laundry floating in it. Creepy monsters. Can you not attack me, please? Can I hide? No. All right, so... Sounds... No! Don't talk to me. No! Why? How? No! No! Balls! hate the door mechanics in this game just make it so I can push it <sighs> did I somehow manage to end up where I was supposed to go I don't know where I'm going I'm lost to a lot of stuff up here and I can unplug I'm just gonna Okay, maybe that was a bad idea. I don't know. I'm just gonna keep yanking buttons. Okay, that was maybe a mistake. What's happening? I can't see. Oh God. follow the red lights it looks like that's kind of convenient oh it might be in is it moving faster than usual oh emergency vessel somewhere over this way probably oh red lights red lights come on oh thank god yes Oh, it's blue. No, that's scary. Don't say that to me. <laughs> Sorry. <sighs> now you calm down. That was way more intense than I thought it was going to be. <laughs> Can you steer this thing? even know what direction we're going in don't worry i'm hooked up to the navigator we're headed for theta should be a matter of minutes i thought i was done for back there seems like the wow was keeping the curie from going into a catastrophic failure state i, I mean how did it get on the ship are you talking about the black tentacles in the engine room i've seen them before at upsilon what are they they're a manifestation of a malfunctioning station-wide artificial intelligence called the wow station-wide so we just made a powerful enemy no, no, it's not like that. The AI isn't a persona. It doesn't feel or think like we do. It's more like, uh, it's more like a cancer. Was that the ship? That makes it sound better. better than expected. Brace for impact! What do you mean? Oh! Hold on, the blast just pushed us off the plateau. What does that mean? If I don't hit Delta, we're dead. Excuse? I'm not seated, I don't think. Can I get up? Oh. Uh, oh, maybe I was seated. Strangely. I'm just gonna snag that real quick. Are you alive? No? Now you're gonna tell me? Ah, oh, 
Dude, I do not want to be here. I know it's gonna be way worse. Never get this open. Yeah, okay. What was that? Oh! I don't wanna look at that. It's entirely too bright. Is this gonna be my little drone friend? Drone friend? Oh, please. Okay, thank God. What are you doing? Oh, singing a happy little song. Where are we? Oh, hey, little guy. Didn't expect to see you again. Don't worry, Cat. I'll find a way to say uh... Yeah, maybe. Oh, God. Little crab guy scared them. Scared the me. Scared the me good. <laughs> so we're at Delta. So that's what you meant by hitting Delta, I guess. <laughs> Literally hit it. Uh, I'm just gonna follow this. Ooh. Okay. Don't get distracted. We got a job to do. I think. God, I really don't like being out under open water. Does that make sense? Is there a roller coaster through here? <laughs> what is that siren head? What? No more of that. That can stop immediately. Those lights are moving. Bad robot? Okay, robot? Is that robot okay? Am I right? Can't believe how much I'm sweating in this suit. Oh. Okay, robot. Surprising. Control room. Why? You're a robot. Robots don't take vacation. Okay. So, Kieran, to answer your question, it is a futuristic game. Let me let me give you a brief rundown of everything that's happened. We were in a car accident in 2015 or close to that year. So we had brain damage and we went into a doctor's appointment for a brain scan. It was supposed to help us repair the damage done to our brain. During the appointment, we suddenly woke up in an in a research facility but it was a, like a derelict station. Come to find out, we're actually 80 some odd years in the future. The, it's an underwater research station. And so far, every human that we've met is just some form of consciousness uploaded to robots with the intent for them to live in a virtual world and be shot into space. Um, and we're not, we're not human anymore. We, we exist in a robot body as well. Mm. And so this stuff is what they called the wow. And I've been running around to save on that. Anyway, so now that we know we're in the future and not our human selves, we're helping Catherine, who has a personality we've uploaded to our little Omni tool device, um, save the project that has a bunch of human consciousness like personalities stored on this device and so we're trying to 
get that launched into space uh, because humanity's been wiped out on the surface apparently wait should I have I don't have a compass or anything I just need to go wherever I'm gonna go what is that something what beep at me maybe there's another location I gotta go to or can I open this it's just a bathroom though okay So this says, well, no, 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 what that means. I'm trying to get to Omicron, I think, or no, we got to get to Theta. That's where we're going. Does this work now? No. Okay. Zeppelin transport theta. Maybe I do have to go do something in a different location. All right, as long as that guy didn't freak out. Control room. I wonder if there's a way in here. That glass is broken. Side. There's a door. Stop flying around out there with your flashlight. You're making stuff move and you're freaking me out. Okay. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Why? Why music change? Stop doing that. Is there another? I think this was. Okay. Pretty sure I saw all of that already. Let's go over here, maybe. A 
I don't like that there's no lights. But there's still a pathway, so maybe there is something over here. I really hope not at this point. Nope. Hate all of those noises. Hate them all. What? Dude, you cannot make noises like that. That was... Dude, stop making noises. For real. You're scaring the bejesus out of me. It's my jump. Okay. So that suit that we found and we got the message from, I mean, looked like it had the helmet ripped off <clears throat> and there was like, <clears throat> excuse me, and hey, blood on the face. Maybe we're wearing one of those and maybe I am still human. I don't know how that would work. It's definitely like 80 years in the future. We would be dead. Unless they found a way to like... I feel like they would have mentioned that though. Or maybe they did and I just forgot. I don't, I don't know. I feel like I'm gonna... Wander around here for a long time. Yeah, sorry. I didn't mean to do that right in front of you, but... Um, is there okay so I went I went around this way nope don't like whale noises got an airlock on it that still works okay ah. hello oh those are eyeballs with a lot of the meat still attached. Why is there nothing else here? Oh. My reflection in the black blood of our warden whispers, I need to save them from this hell. Let them sleep. Lock them in the lucid dreams I've seen. Okay, yeah, no, I read that correctly. Ooh, a chess game. Can I legit play that right now? It's exciting to watch WoW claim Delta half a year ago. I'd be worried I'd have get What? I'd have I don't know what Okay, let's do this It's exciting to watch WoW claim Delta Half a year ago I'd be worried I'd have Goya and Wand clean the black blood from the machinery Now it's crusty surfaces seem to com To complement even outshine what Delta was. This person is nutso. The light is hurting my eyes. He's telling me I don't need this vitreous flesh inside my skull to see salvation. 
I will gladly remove them, stop them from obfuscating this divine mission. So that's why the eyes got it and no other body parts. There's a bunch of drawings here that I don't understand. Corrupt opponent. Okay, well, this is worth trying, I guess. I don't really want to know what's in there. I think I've learned everything I need to learn from here. Moving on. I don't know how to get out of this place, but I very desperately want to leave it. Uh, I keep waiting for the worst jump scare of my life when one of these doors opens. No, no, no. Open it. Come on, little guy. I know you have a torch. You've used it several times. Why are you not opening that? Is there a reason? Oh. That's a creepy thing. Maybe I did miss something in here. Or maybe I can. Mm. I'm done. Signal strength. Shipping. Oh, I forgot that called the the device that they're uploading all of these personalities to. Um. Corrupt audio buffer. Strasky, we can see the Zeppelin now. Good. Sorry about the mess. Without the positioning system, the Zeps just keep losing their set roots. Bulgen did say that you could have fixed it on your side by rejigging the antenna. I guess it doesn't matter now. Are all of you coming? No, just me, Goy, and Creer. Yeah, because instead of being a stubborn old man. Sorry, I just got a really alarming message. Um, so, I don't really know. I wasn't. Peter, can you hear me? Uh, I hear you, Terry. I, I mean, Mr. Akers, sir. I've changed my mind. I would like to come to Theta. Let Delta sleep. Of course. Oh, Wait. Wow. Well, that's terrifying. Eight 
40. Is there something I can do about the signal strength, though? Oh. No way. Are you alive? What? Why is my face doing that? can't interact with either of these people this person seems alive-ish I also don't know how I missed that last time why am why is my character not saying anything about it Simon pay attention wild stuff is going on Is that where I went? That is where I went. Okay. Maybe I can go in here and mess with something. <laughs> what am I so afraid of? Uh, everything? I uh, thought that was pretty evident. Oh. Duh, stupid. Light, universal helper, while the K lacks a voice. Kate. <laughs> Module is able to communicate via simplified sounds and lights. Yeah, it also scares the living daylights out of you if it's following you around. Following you. Vessel has basic intelligence only. A pilot is needed to fully utilize its equipment. Ah. That's interesting. Messages. From Theta. Delta evacuation. Terry, it's been decided that you and your crew will evacuate to Theta on the 14th. Everything is being taken care of and you will all be given new positions as you arrive. We'll have to fall into the ranks, of course. The last thing we need are more leaders. Crunch. Did, did. Theta, it's your funeral. Uh, screw you. I'm not going anywhere. You don't have the authority to make me Terry. <laughs> this isn't my orders, you idiot. I'm just the messenger. You want to stay? I can buy you some time if you want to hang out at your dump. But your crew is moving tomorrow. Strasky. Mr. Akers, I'm happy to inform you that your crew has safely arrived at Theta. Let me know when you're ready to move and I'll send a transport. Merry Christmas, Mr. Akers. Don't hesitate to ask if you want to be relocated to Theta. Access log. Terry Akers won his thousandth game of chess. Uh, is he, is he the one? Corrupt opponent. But why would I need to do any of that? Is there some way? Okay, so th that's commu uh, that's showing all of the possible like transit options. And the Zeppelin is the way to get to... Okay, you aren't helping right now. The Zeppelin is the way to get to Theta. You. Are you gonna do it though? Hey, can you hear me? Help me out here, will you? Brandon, did you move the Carthage casing? We need to test that one before we ship it. 
Balls. You are not helpful either. Let's see. Okay, so 216, I assume that means not going to work. The signal strength, I can't adjust that here. So there must be some way for me to fix that. What? Where? Oh, hang on. Ah, uh, this doesn't help me figure out where. Manually adjust the antenna. That's not that, is it? No. What? I don't. I don't think that's the antenna. Is it? Is there a way for me to get up there? It would appear that is uh, unreachable. Um, okay. Where's the antenna then? Do I maybe follow all these cables somewhere? That's the control room. Established. Okay. So, found that. We're gonna go back over here. We got good signal strength. And we go and... Zeppelin not responding. Crapola then. Uh, let's see. Nope, that doesn't tell me anything. What other ones can I try? 49 went to Theta. 216. <laughs> let's try 049 then, I guess. I really don't want to be bringing anything back from Theta, since it seems like a psychopath took that. Hmm, that's not good. Come on. I didn't think about it. Uh, I didn't think that that changing the channel was going to do anything. Transport active. Unspecified cargo. Yeah, that's what I want to hear. You want to say anything yet? No? Okay. Well, I'm just going to stand here. Oh, balls. Okay. What a terrifying design for a vessel. Unspecified cargo. What is that? Oh, 
that's wild. Makes sense though, because it's, you know, a Zeppelin or whatever. I don't like that I'm gonna have to be exposed to the open ocean on this thing. Oh, it's really disconcerting popping in and out of existence like that. Where are we now? Delta. At least that's what you said before the crash. Oh, right. Of course. Is this a Zeppelin? Appropriately named. You think it can get us to Theta? It's a cargo transport. They use them for moving materials between the sites, anything that's too big for the shuttles. I'm sure it can carry us. Ugh, why won't it work? Come on. Oh, the tool chip is bust. Isn't that part of the Omni tool? <coughs> Who's been paying attention? I have to deal with that back yeah, Finally. Then you know how it works. We need to get a new tool chip and switch it. Mm. Point me in the direction of the closest tool chip storage? I think it would be easier to just take one from a robot. What? Just knock a robot over the head and steal their chips? The toolbox over there says it has a stun baton. You could use that. Come no, on. don't give me a I weapon. Hurt anyone? Isn't this a bit much? It's just a robot, Simon. We're just robots. Sort of. I'll get us the chip. I don't like getting weapons. It means I gotta use them. Guess I have no choice. Wait. Can I have? Hey, you get a tool chip. Where's that guy? I just want to talk, buddy. Where are you at? Oh, there he is. Don't run from me. I know it does. Just let this happen. Thank you. Good Lord. Oh, thank God. I don't have to take. Wait. Yeah, I don't have to take that with me. I'm just going to nab that. Go ahead and close that panel. Shush, shush, little guy. I'm not gonna do that to you. Just don't, don't tell anybody else. I had to. Did I just drop it on the ground? Don't be mad, okay? We really needed that chip. We we'd be stuck here. Could you do it? Kill a robot like that? I get attached to them too. I'm not a monster. But in this case, it had to be done. He was he, 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 he. talking. I mean, he was delusional, but he seemed sincere. Present. Yeah, well, I'm sure it's fine. Was he really that different from us? It's just beginning to sink in. I mean, really sink in. I'm a robot. Didn't we cover this already? I guess I've known ever since I woke up at Upsilon just keep suppressing it like my brain doesn't want me to think about it it's really getting hard not to think about it yeah could you maybe hit that switch over there so we could get moving oh yeah sure <laughs> and away we go i don't want to ride this thing why do there need to be monitors over in the corners i don't want to do anything on this thing oh god this is the worst form of transportation ever imagined. Ugh. It's like being in a shark cage with no top and then dragged around through shark infested waters. Except the sharks in this case are like crazy robot Cthulhu hybrid things. I don't want to be here. No, something weird's gonna happen, and then we're gonna get dropped down in a in the abyss. Oh God, it's so dark down there. Just lay face down. Gonna do that. I just don't want to look at anything. You're really good back there, Simon. Yeah. Detour, but we're back on track. Yeah. We should touch down on a cargo platform just outside Theta. Then we just head inside, grab the dun back, and head down the abyss. 
worry though because with the Dunbat, they aren't going to bend in the Mariana. The Dunbat? Trench. You don't hold for anything. That's great. And then we can start <laughs> oh, he's freaking out just like I am. <laughs> because that's how conversations work. What? Oh. We're not. Sorry. I just can't stop thinking about what Not even halfway. Come. It's clear that we're no longer human. But then how can I feel like Simon? How can I feel like anything at all? I mean, technically, I don't have any ears, no mouth. Christ, it's a weird thing to think about. I mean, I'm making sounds. I'm still saying things. You sure are. <sighs> okay. Your new body most likely has senses similar to those you had as a human. And your mind, only knowing one way to perceive the world, superimposes that skill set on top of your new features. So my mind is covering it up, pretending nothing's different. If it didn't, you'd probably be incapable of interacting with the world at all. And the stress would either kill you or make you go insane. So I've found a good balance between awareness and ignorance. Does that mean I shouldn't think about this stuff, or are my thoughts actually making me cope? Could I tip the balance by suddenly gaining some insight and go insane? I wouldn't worry about it. I mean, we have real things to deal with. Saving mankind, remember? Speaking of which, we're closing in on Theta. I'll eject the Omni tool. As always, don't forget to take me with you. Uh, Kath, before you go, the artificial intelligence you mentioned in the escape vessel? Uh-huh, yeah, the warden unit, the WoW. Is it the WoW's fault that we're like this? I mean, it seems like something an unreliable AI would do. I suppose it set the ball in motion, but it's not directed with purpose. <laughs> it's really complicated to explain how machines think, Simon. Concentrate on getting inside data, okay? See you soon. Oh boy. Huh. The glowy blue bits don't make me feel good. Uh, and this place is eerie. Something happened to Acres. It sounded like an explosion. Mm. Oh God. Ooh. Thank you, Catherine. Wait. Am I already here? What? <laughs> Looks like Johnny Five up here. Hello? Who is that? Mark? No, we haven't met before. Is this Mark? I think we're safe. Oh, I was so worried something had gone wrong. What's your name? Robin Bass. Theta Field Service Technician. Nice to meet you, Robin. I think we read about her in the... Here? I got scanned, like the others, and then I killed myself. At Whoa. least I think so. I can't remember that part. How does that work? Did dying get you into the Ark? Wow, you're definitely not from Theta. Let me guess, Omicron? Wasn't sure Catherine would be able to scan you guys. You're lucky. There was a lot of talk about this at Theta. The idea is, when you're activated in the Ark, there's basically two of you, right? One human, one living skin in the Ark. 
You don't want your copy to survive you. You yourself want to survive on the Ark. If the human you dies before the scan is initiated, or closely after, you yourself would live on in the Ark. Amazing, right? Did Catherine put you up to this? Killing yourself? Catherine Chun? No. I don't think you understand. She just did scans and put them into the Ark. I hope I get to meet her soon so I can apologize. She always got into trouble with Strawmeyer when someone killed themselves. I think she's okay with it. Where is everyone? I thought there would be like 40 or 50 people here. I don't know. Uh, I'll let you know if I see anyone. 40 or 50? Robin. I'm not sure how to say this. What? This... This is... Yeah? Pretty amazing, right? I mean, the Ark. Yeah, it's great. Catherine and the guys have really pulled through. They saved us all. Uh, so am I supposed to unplug her? Because I see a way to do it. See you later. Will do. No, I'm not going to do it. Also, no, to answer your question. But maybe I shouldn't have said that since I'm going to leave you alive. <laughs> Open. Open. Oh, God. do the thing now do the thing do it there hmm what a very distracting sequence of events I hope there's nothing on the outside that hears this going on and then races at me right now. Oh God. Oh, it's not even open yet. Not really. <laughs> I'm paranoid. <laughs> okay. Is there anything in here that's immediately going to try and kill me? No? Flashlight sucks. Access granted. Welcome to Theta. Oh, that sounded like. No, oh, what's happening? Oh, okay. A heck of a stutter there. Nope. Bright light. Bunch of other stuff. Hello? Anyone there? Uh, leave that. Catherine, we found data. like we're going over there oh I'm gonna take this with me because it is going straight through there Can I do something with this? No. Nope. Don't like the presence of Vince. No matter how.
how much they might make sense. We're here? We're here! Okay, great. Time to hijack ourselves a submarine. There will be nothing yeah. stopping us when we have the dumb bat. Yeah, sure <laughs> have a lot of machines and vehicles down here. What makes this one so special? It's the only transport that can go into the abyss without cracking like a can of soup. I don't want to go if to the abyss. The kind, then how did they get the Ark down the abyss in the first place? That's a good question. I suppose they did it the hard way and just walked. Didn't realize that was an option. Kath, what's it like inside the Ark? Is it like a movie or virtual reality? No, of course not. It's, you know, like real life, but slightly better. Pleasant temperature, clean air. Good weather. So people in the Ark just walk around pretending it's the real world? You don't have to pretend. It's perfectly immersive. And it can mm. just sustain itself. Yes. Attached to a probe fueled by solar panels, it could survive for thousands of years. That's amazing. Just thinking about the Earth being what it is and us setting out to save the final remains of humanity, it's... It's... Heroic? Uh, at least it feels worth doing. Here we go. The Dunbat. Oh, damn it. I knew it was too good to be true. What's wrong? It's... It, it's quarantined. Hold on. We need a security cipher. How bad a is what? it? A what? It's we don't write these things down type of bad. Maybe someone's still around who can tell us what it is. Hmm, sure. Let's go with that. I'll just unlock the other doors for you so you can explore the station. Can you warn me next time you do that? We need to find someone who knows the cipher. It's the only way to fire up the Dunbat. Well, I'm taking this stress ball with me. No, 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 my stress ball. So I don't get to have my Omni tool this whole time. That seems strange. Dead gimmick. Don't let me forget that the stress ball is there. Nope. Nope. Yeah. What do you mean? Oh. Uh, no. No. Main level. This is where I am. Okay. Level one. Black box beacon. And level two. Looks like all your friends moved downstairs. Why abandon the gate? And the habitat? That's so strange. I don't like this at all. Deceased. Astrodynamics expert is not deceased. Missing. Deceased. Deceased. Not anything. Not anything. Deceased. There's guests here. Oh, they're from the different. Okay. Find someone who knows the security. <laughs> Who would know? Strohmeyer? I can't... M hmm. Maybe there's somewhere I can go. I gotta go to the bathroom. Hmm. 
Can I like click on a name? Maybe I can, maybe I can go across oh. now. That was terrifying. I don't want to go that way. This seems better. God. Thanks, Drama. That's a real helpful report. Be quiet. The proxy listens. What happened to Theta? No explanations anywhere. That sounds like a warning. I don't want to go this way anymore. It's getting worse. Okay. Do I want to go? Maybe. Um, that just doesn't look like I can get back if I go this way. Uh, I made a decision. I don't like that I made the decision. No. I feel like I'm being tricked here. So, dead end. Looks like maybe I go toward the screaming. Or I can go in here first. Uh. Oh, cool. There's a, uh, a wheezing body stuck in there. I'm just going to close this. Guy. You're not gonna have like a weird robot chestburster come out of you, are you? Because oh, you're not interactable. Got it. Don't tell anybody I'm here. sucks I'm sorry okay bye uh, boy this is where the screaming came from nope nope something going on over here that I can nope that person is sort of alive oh okay did they just teleport did that thing just teleport around what what was that Step by this thing. Okay. I don't I don't know how to navigate this situation at all.
Uh-oh. This is gonna suck, because... Uh... Terrifying. Ouch. <laughs> Hated that. What? Where am I now? Pledge, dude. Just standing over the top of me like that? This seems not fair. No. Come on. What is all of this? Flash warning. Oh, that's the first. Uh, press any button to try again. Okay. Alright, so I know there's nothing in there. And there's just this guy. We're gonna give that thing kind of would have been cool to finish this whole game without that happening but that is no longer possible okay so which way are you going Set the router, got it. Okay, what does that mean? I know what that means, but like, where the heck is the router? And also, the year's like 2104 or something crazy like that. Hey, you're not gonna tell on me, are you? Cables all over the place. Is the router? Hmm. I don't know which cable it would be, but maybe this one. This game right now it's getting a little intense okay the cable just kind of disappeared maybe I wasn't really following it seen a router or anywhere okay never mind <coughs> excuse me 
Hmm. Maybe it's that cable. Maybe I. Oh, well, that's not real helpful, actually. Somewhere I haven't been. So. way it is really hard to tell which direction you're going okay so there has to be some sort of I don't know intuitive thing that I'm not intuiting Right? Okay. Maybe I do need to go into that oop, dead end area that it I initially went to. Please don't see me. Oops. That's a new noise. I don't know what I'm going to do if she comes around that corner. God, that was only like super stressful. Good to know though. Okay. Anybody else terrified? <laughs> mm -hmm. That was the first thing I could interact with that I've run into in this room. need to is it maybe something outside of this room is that a possibility just gonna pop 
pop out here. Nope. Need to close. Dang it, I thought you were gonna be a thing. Is it out of the room? Oh my God. Okay. Why? No, you need to go. I hate this. So it can come out of the room, which is just lovely. I don't know. I don't know how close I can get to it and still move. I also don't know why I think I need to be quiet. Oh, this is dumb. But it can open doors. That's the part that makes me a little upset because I, I would have loved to have been able to just trap that guy. No, no. Set router. Is it back in the room now? Damn it. I wonder if my flashlights matter or the use of my flashlight matters at all. Yes. Yeah. OK, 
Okay, I have no idea what to do here. And this is getting uh, frustrating. Because I don't know what to do. I need to take this over there. I know this is probably dumb, but at this point I'm willing to try anything because it is not clear to me what I should do. Oh, that makes me so mad. I've been doing this for so much longer than I needed to. What did I do? Okay, so there's a bunch of other stuff on the screen now. And it's mad. And it's going away again. Okay. All right. What does the screen say now? Mainframe online. Router active. Okay, so I did the thing that apparently I was supposed to do, which means I go into the other room with all the other machines and technology. Sounds like it's in front of me. Nope, shush, shush groaning guy. Okay, so I do something in here now? No. Do I get out of here? You. Maybe I go upstairs. Okay. 
So maybe, maybe I did something that affected the first level. Uh, but it sounds like there's another one up here. Good job, Sam. It's better if Shut your mouth. Going down there again. In fact, that sounds like it's coming from the other side of that gate. Which is not a pleasant thought. Alright, super creepy tunnel time. Huh? It's like they all just cleared out. You yeah, maybe for good reason, guys. I'm gonna touch this thing. Uh. Oh, wait, I'm one with the wow or whatever. No. What the hell are you doing? I didn't do it. I know it looks bad, but it makes me feel a lot better. Helps me focus. That's. I mean, that's the wow you're hooking up to. I need it, okay? I wouldn't have made it this far without it. Let's just keep going. Uh, so have I not? Should I have not been doing any of that ever? Oh boy. Was it a mistake to do that? Was it? There wasn't anything in here, right? You're not, you're not doing anything. Got it. Okay. What's so interesting downstairs? Just labs and offices. Maybe the shuttle station. Should we go check? Rather not. Got a bad feeling about this. Yeah. Well, so the first thing you should know is that. What was that? There's a lot of noises I'm not making. Anyway. If people are congregating in an area, it's either because A, there's something cool in that area, or B, there's something not cool everywhere else. Maybe they wanted to keep close to the shuttle station in case something went wrong. You're really stuck on that one. I'm just worried about my colleagues. I'm not. I'm worried about, uh, about me. <laughs> Thought you were a thing. This is where I did my scan. And all the others, I suppose. You don't remember? My scan was the first. Had to test the scanner before I could start making promises. No, my scan was the first. My scan was in 2015. Uh, Strasky, come in. I need help in the lab, the scan room. What happened? Conrad killed himself after the scan. <laughs> Jesus, how? Maser tool? What should I do? I'm gonna need to tell Strohmeyer. No, please! I'm so close. Strohmeyer's gonna shut down the ARC project. It's not my fault people keep killing themselves. Catherine, what are you gonna do? It's not like you can sneak a 300 pound body out of the lab. I know. Catherine, are you okay? Not even close. So people were taking their own lives because it wasn't going to be their physical body living on in the ark and everything that they had experienced after the scan wouldn't go with them onto the ark. Now, their scanned selves wouldn't be aware of that. So it's not like it would matter in the end, but their physical selves were probably going through some weird thoughts about all that. It was probably very difficult to deal with. Budge was that noise. Okay. Okay. Image read. May the 4th, 2072. Hi, Conrad. January 31st. That's my brother's birthday. Mm -hmm. 
His name is that guy. Or Conrad, actually. Water filled steel tank sensory limiter. Transfer file. Restricted file. No external device. Okay, with pilot seat, better continuation. Not necessary for ARC. Agreeable exterior applied to ARC. Versailles. Agreeable interior test. Excellent. Data reconstructed by WoW. Do not use. <coughs> May the 4th be with you. Yeah. Ah, also, what? May the 4th is on a Saturday. Man. I'm getting a bad feeling about. Oh, that's not cool. Why did they set it up like that? What? Paul Berg. What was our name again? Simon. David Munchie. Oh. How did this? What is this? Wait a minute. April 28th, 2015, Paul Berg, David Munchie. Ah, ah, ah. May 23rd, 2078. Simon Jarrett? Oh! What is this? Why do you have a file of me? You are one of Dr. Munchie's templates, the legacy scan. Oh, dude. Post scan recording. This is what we're going to have said. Okay, that's it. Wow. That was fun. That's a relief. Still figuring this out, so. It was freaky. So many lights. What do we do now? Paul and I are going to run tests for a week or so, and then we'll work out a roadmap to your recovery. Well, I feel excited. Can't wait to get back to the living. Dude, that's wild. We've worked everything out. Everything is legal. Vouched for by Dr. Peak and Professor Wei. Oh, that's great news. No big change in medication. You'll be taking an aspirin every morning, but that's about it. Paul worked out a diet with some variations you should try out. You can continue doing physical therapy. Also, there's some extra cardio training every other day. Okay, getting complicated. Don't worry, it's really not. We're gonna keep an eye on you every week, so we'll be able to adjust the plan if needed. The model was sound. It should have worked. It's not your fault, David. I really wish things had turned out differently. Yeah, me too. I was supposed to save you. Hey, you got my brain on file. Maybe you can put it to some use. <laughs> yeah, who knows? You'd be okay with that? Using it for my research? Sure. It's like a part of me lives on or something. Like a donated organ. You know what sucks about dying? What? The crash. Everything up till now. The brain damage. You guys, everything. It's made my life so much more real. I started thinking about all the things I was going to do. I'd never been more excited to be alive. All that hope. Wasted. What's a legacy scan? They're historic templates for AI construction. Any self respecting engineer wouldn't use legacies anymore, but they're great for learning. They come with every development kit. So, my brain scan turned into a template for artificial intelligence. You should be proud. So much for that mystery. No magic or time travel needed. I was here all along. Waiting for someone to shove a picture of my brain into a suit and hit the power button. Okay, so... 
we died a month later. It has been a minute, Santiago. Welcome back. We just, we ended up dying the same day. When I started the art project, I pretty much lived in this lab. Okay, that's cool. Stop talking. You're scaring me a lot. I definitely heard stuff moving around up here. Scan projector active. Insert a chip containing scan data. That's what I mean. I heard footsteps again. Stop it with the footstep noises, please. Tromeyer reprimanded me. One more death and we're out. Robin, we met her outside. September sometime. Okay. I wonder what caused us this is to where I would store the arc scans. Are they similar to my legacy file? No, yours is flatter, if that makes sense. Less dynamic. Thanks. That makes me feel much better. Yeah, well this flat personality is about to save your butt. So I'm flat scan. I'm a flat scanner. All you globers. Relying on me. Wouldn't that be a fun game? <laughs> Where it's up to a flat earther to save the globe. do it a thing what's up capri sun drinker 3000 there should be a list of people see if there's anyone who could know a security cipher strohmeyer no uh let's see she'd help out delivering the ark uh, continuity Strohmeyer is really mad has tightened security um, Delta refugee construct ringleader is working for Strohmeyer now another continuity suicide Strohmeyer locked me out of my lab again looks so much alike in a different life I'm sure we'd be best friends anything it should make the post scan hangover less severe stress scan is cheerful and funny as always she said she'd help construct the arc but not carry it uh okay doesn't say anything about what they do where was that list of I need to go back downstairs, I think. Oh, wait. Does this say anything about jobs? No. Okay. Oh, 
I'm still here in push jam noises. What? Okay. Don't want to go through that door yet. The legacy scan of me that was on the computer. What did you use it for? It's a template that has an intelligence scary. power already executed. The game name is scary. Uh, so, if I wanted to build an AI, I wouldn't have to reinvent a whole model. I would be able to focus on the things that the AI is to be used for. Is every AI self-aware? Do they also think they're Simon? What? No, Simon. Don't worry. It's not like we just put people into robots and machinery and let them run free. That'd be really cruel. It doesn't work like that. Or at least mm. it didn't used to work like that. Truly sentient machines. Thinking they are people is definitely new. But you kept them sentient for the Ark. Yes, and I basically had to invent the method. Okay. Astrodynamics, field service, intel systems engineer. Oh, that's Catherine. Keith, biometrics, software coordinator, system architect, first responder, payload manager, medical doctor, software engineer. I didn't. I don't remember seeing Ian Peterson on that list. Security optic. Maybe. Maybe we'll check. Is there any other security person? John's daughter. Uh, nope. So who did we have up there? I feel like I saw that one, but Conrad. Admin supervisor, but I don't think they were on that list. So I'm thinking, thinking maybe uh, where did where did her, what was her name? Shoot, why am I so? We'll check, maybe. Anyway, yeah, uh, LSP gotcha, but it's Soma is the name of the game. Sorry, they were talking, so I didn't want to interrupt. Um, Any chill. What the hell is even that? Why am I crouching? It should be fine. I say that and then everything goes south. I'm just gonna run up here. Oh. I forgot. I did that. Uh, I don't think we're that close to the end. But, but I don't know. Maybe. Mm -hmm. We need someone from Theta Security Group. Bruh. So, just one by one then? <laughs> just gonna. Theta Security Group. Somebody from Theta. Well, let's just oh, let's go one by one. That one won't work either. Look for security people like Kronstadt or Stromeyer. I is are there other pages or something? What do you mean? Get the simulator going. There we are. 
What are we doing exactly? We're gonna have a talk with Mr. Wan. Use the computer to activate the simulation. I can't give him an environment or a module, so good luck with this. That wasn't so bad. This room might really got me worked up, bastard. What? What happened? Where did everyone go? Mr. Wan. Chun? What happened? I, I, I can't see anything. There's nothing here. It's okay. It's all a part of the scam. No, no, that, that's a lie. You're lying. Don't get upset, Mr. Wan. No, 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 no. Why are, you, why are you doing this to me? I trusted you, Chun. I trusted you! Did we just bring that guy to life? I mean, he's a perfect scan, meant for the Ark. He's the real deal. And we turned him off. Took it all away again. I really thought that was gonna work. Maybe we can try again. The same guy? Oh my god. That wasn't so bad. This room might really got me worked up, bastard. What? What happened? Where did everyone go? Take it easy, Mr. Wong. Chuck? What happened? I, I can't see anything. There's nothing here. Don't worry, Mr. Wong. It'll all get better. No, no, that, that's a lie. You're lying. <laughs> okay, calm down, Mr. Wong. No, 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 no. Wait! Simon, you just reset the simulation. Yeah, you were doing a bad job again. That wasn't so bad. This room might really got me worked up, bastard. What? What happened? Where did everyone go? Mr. Wan. Chun? What happened? I, I can't see anything. There's nothing here. It's okay. It's all a part of the scam. No, no, that's, that's a lie. You're lying. Mr. Wan, I need you to stay calm. No, 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 no. Well, why, are you, why are you doing this to me? I trusted you, Chun. I trusted you! This setup won't work. We need something else. There are more memory chips? That one's cleaned out. Uh, I'm certain. Looks like this one's gonna be too. I just run it again. Simulation info. I can why can't I Is there a way to wipe that clean? That wasn't so bad. Try it one more time. this
Okay, so he's gonna freak out because he can't see anything, but I don't know how to load anything like that. Uh. Oh, test environments. Ah, here we go. Agreeable exterior test. What does this say? Excellent. Data reconstructed by WoW. Do not use. Okay. No external device detected. Where me plug in? Oh, there we go part that looks like it except that discarded you know, use scan room with pilot seat better continuation not necessary for arc water field oh to chip chip already contains this file okay zero place for aha oh thanks for the sub capri son beach run God dang it. Really wrong this place. This isn't real. This isn't real. I have to get out of None here. of it's real. It would never was going to be real. God. Do we need to turn it off? Can we just keep him alive until we've got the cipher? The longer he's exposed to the computer model, the more he'll get hung up on it. So what's wrong with letting him settle in a little? It would drive him insane. So let's keep the session short and the suffering to a minimum. Let's try the ski lodge. That wasn't so bad. to build the scene so it's more what he'd expect as soon as he starts to doubt we've lost him you're right we need to think this through we need some more data uh, this guy is really starting to make me mad <laughs> okay was there anything no i don't think there was anything there but Float tank scan room. Better continuation, not necessary for arc. Be a better gamer. No, don't tell me what to do. <laughs> Okay, so it has beach and ski lodge on there.
Oh my god, I just read Nate's comment. <laughs> you should never tell people to do something they're incapable of doing. <laughs> it's insensitive. Okay. What was this talking about? Uh, Strasky, come in. I need help in the lab, the scan room. What happened? Okay, no, I don't care about that. Okay, that's not the thing. Transfer denied. Okay. Those are my only options for environments. Just because I'm getting anxious. I'm gonna just have to like clear the chip. need a module what do you mean oh 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 well but okay Plug that in. Where would I? Hang on. Module none. So if I move these people over I can't though Dang it I thought for sure that was going to be the answer Taking this with me, and I guess we're going this way. Yeah, squishy noises. The stress ball there. <laughs> Why is my heart beating like that? Uh, that scared the 
but Jesus enemy, by the way. Hello? Any mod files in here? You know what? Go look for Brandon's room. Uh, an investigation. I'm sure we can mm -mm. get to him somehow. Mm -mm. Why is that elevator broken? Brandon's room. Okay. Guy Conrad. I don't want to lock that. Here we go. Brandon Wan's room. I'll just override the lock for you. Yeah, yeah. Why is it so dark? If we get to know him, maybe we can make the simulation of a Acres finally agreed to evacuate Delta, Goya Cryer, and I moved into Theta today. Acres said he'd stick around for a while longer, that crazy dude. I take pride in my work, but god dang. The place is miserable since the surface stopped sending parts. My arc scan together with Alice. A girl named Alice. They did their scans together. Alice Coster? We could try to make him think that she's there during the simulation. It might make him talk. I'm not sure how, though. Keep looking. Biggest pain was the Chun girl. She's so uncomfortable at all times it makes my skin crawl. Okay, so <laughs> Catherine, you shouldn't be talking <laughs> to him at all. Strohmeyer went ballistic and shut down all future scans for the ARC project. Just heard that the Como Rebi Como Rebi survey team is going to Delta and pick up acres. He's been alone for months now. Can't imagine what he's been up to. Oh, they died. Pretty sure. Nope. I wanted to look at this too. Bear Child Award. on the intercom. Seems like they were getting ready to leave. You got that from the intercom? Must be a transmission buffer. Hang on. Great. This is exactly what we need. I think we got this, Simon. I can synthesize Alice's voice from the intercom and use it to impersonate her for the simulation. I can trick them into feeling safe enough to open up. Great. Definitely feeling good about that. Good job with the intercom. I didn't know you could data mine. What's it like? It's just something that I do now. So it comes naturally to you. That's really interesting. Yeah, I'll make sure to add it to my dating profile. The teddy bear could use some repairs. Toby always breaks. He's top heavy, so he keeps falling over. Ooh. <laughs> I'm reading your diary. Image and read tested a machine today. It was clearly corrupted by WoW, but more importantly, it was assembled in a seemingly primitive way. Like someone had specifically created it for WoW to steal. When activated, the machine mimicked the room and read along with it. At some point, she was scanned and then loaded as a simulation inside the digital space. Presentation shocked read and was quickly terminated. It scare me how much it reminds me of my AR capsule. After dissecting the vivarium machine that Reed activated, it's clear that WoW copied my com the capsule project to construct the scene to hold the Reed simulation. It's actually very similar in its construction except for one point. Where my capsule houses flat people constructed from model neurographs, the vivarium's brain scan lives on. It isn't limited by its content. From the originating brain scan, Reed emerged. The 
read inside the vivarium was a perfect copy. I have it. I can save humanity. I can build an artificial reality capsule that can hold every living member of Pathos 2. I can't figure out how it worked with the vivarium, but I can replicate WoW's scanning technique using the pilot seats. They are already prepared with the type of electromagnetic drums needed. <coughs> it's even easier than I thought. The pilot seats are already set to allow the diffraction and high energy needed to capture the scan. I suspect WoW has been using the seat to steal scans from us for a while. I guess that explains the mockingbirds. The WoW must have stolen scans from people using the pilot seat and used it as a basis for intelligence in the machines. With a surprisingly positive reaction from the team, we have now officially started the ARC project. We're going to scan all the people we can find and load them into the capsule. Then we'll launch it into space using the space gun. It's nice to think something will live on like that. Mark Serang ended his life after his scan. He's been suggesting everyone should do the same, as it would somehow allow them to actually get on the Ark. I'm not sure how that would work. It did trigger a lot of arguments among the staff, and apparently it's my fault somehow. Strohmeyer is not happy with me. Hope it'll calm down. But you gave me a set of AI templates I haven't seen before. I unfolded one of them to make a new friend for Capsule Catherine and her gang of legacies. New way to simulate turbulence makes the weather system so much better. Implemented Reed didn't go well. New try with Reed. Reed won't play nicely with others. She's too real. Hmm. Uh, where is my hairbrush? You Oops. have a lot of toys. <laughs> I broke one of them. Or lost it. I don't know what happened there. Nothing in there. Was that ball there before? gonna be no lights in here I almost closed that on my side okay all right so no reason to come in here except to get scared that was fine is over there. Robin! Oh god. Why would you lock a locker? Oh wait. I'm sorry. Oh, was it this? faith and serang and the continuity good what would lord the real simon would have thought if he knew about me what do you mean you do know about yourself no i i mean the real simon the human simon going by your reactions i'd say he'd be pretty upset
helps also. Who's the first one to do it? There better be a light switch in here. Oh, that's weird. That's a lot of nerd stuff. Wow, that's a lot of words. Good thing I'm not reading them. What is the nature of identity? Ooh. Who are you? What does it mean to be human? Does your body or your surroundings confine or define you? All very difficult ideas to approach without having your questions be invalidated by the practical or mystified by the spiritually minded. In this book, <laughs> professor of philosophy at the Charles University in Prague guides you through the history of great thinkers and what they have to say about identity. This is classified. company is very pleased to hear about your success in making the wow a station-wide presence we trust you appreciate what a unique opportunity this is and that you will do everything in your power to fully explore and understand this mystery to do so you need to ensure that dr johan ross is able to steer and study the wow from alpha without outside interference in case of an emergency you may direct julia Dahl at omicron to forcefully eliminate any opposition but please make an effort to avoid extreme actions Wow is an important, costly affair, and we hope to follow a steady development without setbacks. Supervisory board. Stuff and things. Nope. Nothing. Okay. There's another note here. Uh, dear friends, when you read this, I'll have entered the Ark. As I've explained, this is accomplished by ceasing to live as your scan is being completed to not frighten Catherine I will do this in secret by folding cyanide salts into chewing gum placing it in my mouth before seeing her when I hear her announce completion I will bite down quickly causing my own demise when you discover the truth behind my death no there's no tragedy to mourn for I am victorious I advise, I advise you all to do the same and join me inside the ark Okay, so crazier than the logical explanation I had previous. Did you know that the human body consists of up to 75 trillion individual cells? Oops. No, don't start over. Did you know that the human body consists of up to 75 trillion individual cells? They typically don't stay with us till we die. Some live a few days while others live a few years. We're not affected by their short lifespans, as they're replaced by new cells which help sustain our bodies. I don't think anyone would argue that we ever lose our persona due to this process. Yet we are clearly in a constant state of transformation. <laughs> then how do we remain the same? A continuous flow of thought and perception keeps an unbroken chain of continuity that we know as our self. Our conscious mind is not the pattern of our brain, but a continuous, emergent entity based on that pattern. When Dr. Chun populates the Ark, she is capturing a moment of our existence and placing it inside the digital world. Soon you and your digital you will grow apart due to diverging experiences, but for a tiny window, you are the very same. With unbroken continuity, it will live on. A fulfilling life, no doubt. No less real than the one from which it was plucked. Now remember, you are not your body. You are the emergent entity. That entity just happens to occupy two places at once for a while. If you took away your body, you would simply be the only one you can be. The you inside the ark let your body die and continue on in the digital paradise among the stars you know for a really smart guy that was a pretty stupid conclusion uh to be honest there is no transference <laughs> your physical body dying it doesn't you don't then wake up uh it, it like it doesn't matter 
like you could die of natural causes 30 years later and this and the same thing will happen you wouldn't know like <laughs> that's so frustrating it's like with clones I mean, that's that's what they are is digital clones but Strohmeyer don't make noises like that if you ever have your brain scanned and uploaded to a you know database of any sort don't do that please it'd be it would be dumb to do that Wisconsin beats. Hm. What's this? Oh. Oops. Oh, my face got a little glitchy there. That's always disconcerting. Okay, was there something up here? nothing in here except for this which i'm very interested in but also oh never mind i thought there was going to be more to that okay i feel like i would remember that there was a medicine ball in the hallway Something open that door just now? Dude, that scared me so bad. My arms hurt. Okay, I guess we're gonna go over here. Not going down. Or up, actually. making a lot of weird noises okay so there's nothing that way <laughs> Just screw that whole section of the building not be okay was that always open that makes me real uncomfortable I that wasn't always open that's new Oh man. That was 
wasn't so bad. This robot really got me worked up, bastard. Well, that's what you get for listening to his stories. I guess I had it coming. About Strohmeyer. He said he needed a new site for ASAP. What should I tell him? It's all right. I can talk to him. What are you? Didn't Chum just tell you to take it easy? Don't worry, I'm not going to tell anyone. I do feel hungover. Okay. It's 1729 over 42, 12 over 407. Got it? Yeah, I got it. I'm sorry, Mr. Long. Red. Goodbye. No, wait. That's enough. We got what we need. Is that what we are? Simulations? Yeah, but it shouldn't make any difference. You're still you. I'm not sure what to do with the data. You decide. Rest in peace, Brandon. <laughs> God dang. Uh... I don't want to open that door. In fact, I need to pee. <laughs> Belonging the inevitable. I didn't murder. I erased. Just like Arnold Schwarzenegger in that one movie. Seriously, was that? What is the objective again? <laughs> What was that? The game just auto save quietly. Okay, security code. Simon, we got it. We can get to the dumb bat now. Get back here. You say that like it's gonna be the easiest thing in the world for me to get back there and it's totes not gonna be because something's been following me around down here up here whatever i hate that noise catherine couldn't we just have extracted the cipher from brandon's data somehow so cruel bringing him back like we did. No, that's impossible. Memories don't work like that. Let's just hope it was worth it. Why does it feel like that wasn't open? But what is that? Oh God, I don't want to open this. There's a reason that everybody abandoned this area. I feel terrible about the Brandon thing. Bunch of scientists and researchers that don't understand. It's for a good cause. I don't know why I did that. But I'm closing that just in case. There you are. Just warming up the Dunbat for us. 
It's been collecting dust for months, so it might need a minute. Okay, that's it. That's everything. That, that was supposed to happen? Huh. That's weird. Huh. Never mind. What do you need me to do? Head inside the dock. The Omnitool can open the door now. And get into the Dunback. Then plug me in, and I'll take us into the Abyss. Sounds easy enough. <laughs> gonna put me in that corner for a reason I hate this also if you ever say to me if I'm ever with you in a situation like this and you ever say to me the words huh that's weird and then do not explain I will end your existence the next time I see you <laughs> if I do get to see you I will definitely not help you do whatever the thing is. Okay, Dunbad is up there. Which is a weird name for this thing. Possibly not that weird. I just don't know what the acronym stands for. And I keep thinking Dungbat. makes me think of Ace Ventura when nature calls and they feed him bat guano What did she say to do? I don't know how to do any of this. I need to plug her into the system over here somewhere. Why does why does this feel like a room where I'm gonna run around while she does a bunch of like system checks or something? Well, I gotta get it started up. I'm gonna need a minute. And then I'm going to run around in circles from this intensely scary monster that has actually been uh, following me through the facility the whole time. Do I have to... What do I... Watch out for moving doors. Okay. Oh. That's a vent. These aren't really wanting to move. Do I go up and down, left and right? Around in a circle? Did I not do something I was supposed to do? Maybe? There's something over here that I could have interacted with, maybe? No? Not a dang thing on that terminal either. Is there a way to check my. Uh, no. <laughs> maybe. Am 
I supposed to be able to? Oh. Sure, that needed to be a thing. As long as that vent stays locked, I'm fine. No, no. Catherine, guess what? That thing that you wanted to tell me about but didn't mention well, it became a problem. So now I have to climb through a vent. So thanks. I guess that was supposed to happen, so. Hooray! screams coming from this direction. It's fine. Why is this even possible? Guess what? I'm touching the thing. I probably shouldn't do this like that, but. Maybe it eventually it'll be really bad for me to do that. I don't know. Talking. That's rarely a good sign. Damn it. The Dunbat was our best shot. I was really banking on this to work. Come on, <laughs> you can't quit now. There's got to be another way. How do you think you did it? How did the <coughs> team get the Ark down the abyss in the first place? If they didn't use the Dunbat, the only other way would be the climber in Omicron. It's like an elevator which supposedly reaches all the way down into the abyss. <laughs> so we do that. We go to Omicron and take the elevator. Yeah. Okay. Sure. We'll just head over to Omicron and hope there's a power suit that fits you. You know, so you don't implode while in the abyss. <laughs> that does sound useful. All right, let's go then. Wait, what is this place? Seems to be a lot of information on the art here. There's a prototype and everything. Okay. Let's start it up. I want to see how it works. Maybe we can figure out how to get on the arc. You didn't know how to get us on? How difficult could it be? What? I hate you right now. My decision. I've decided to finalize the arc with the scans we have. I'm sorry for all of you who wanted to go but didn't get a chance to scan yourself before the project was put on hold. 
It's been two months since I've added a scan and I don't see how I'll ever be able to win back the support you all showed when we started the project. I'm sorry. I never meant for anyone to take their lives. It was never my intention to fool anyone. I just wanted to save something. Dr. Catherine Chun. Apply interface module, seal, arc capsule, ask permission from 4Q, brief, Devashkin, Lindwall, Peterson, and Hill, take shuttle to Omicron, pick up power suits, ride the climber into the abyss, regroup a Tau, head to the launch site, load the bullet, launch arc. Arc locator, it's at Tau. Uh, whoops. Didn't mean to do that. To gauge staff opinion, please fill out this short survey. Recently, it was decided the ARC project would become Pathos 2's last official commitment. Staff has been urged to carry on with their duties despite Earth's catastrophic condition. To think the ARC project is the most logical step towards saving mankind and that we should spend as much time and resources as needed to complete it. Uh. Disagree. To embark, every passenger needs to be flushed with electromagnetism using a pilot seat. These scanning sessions are known to cause nausea and headaches, sometimes lasting up to three days. I think temporary physical discomfort, no matter how severe, is a small price to save mankind. I mean, I do, I strongly agree with that, but that's not what we're doing. So, I mean, it's kind of a loaded question. Uh, the Ark is built to fit a Ranger Mark 7 probe, meaning it could be shot into space with the Omega space gun and technically survive for thousands of years, living off the light from our sun and distant stars. I think the Ark should leave Earth behind and be launched into space. I mean, there's no other point if you don't do that, so... The digitalization of humanity is an opportunity to make a quantum leap in our own evolution. The people inside the Ark will out of necessity be generated from existing genetic code, but could be altered to allow for cosmetic changes, ease aging, and even prevent death. I think we are at risk of losing our humanity if we were to rid ourselves of disease and, immor uh, and our mortality. Um starting to make a lot less sense because i thought the point would be for you to be able to live forever um as code uh disagree there are only 58 people left alive to be stored inside the ark a way to diversify and expand the population would be to introduce artificial intelligences that would in every way appear to be human but with childlike and naive sensibilities. As we continue to explore the nature of intelligence, we may find a way to make them smarter in the future. I think even an inferior group of artificial people would be ben would benefit our society. Uh, disagree. Thank you for participating. This is how your colleagues voted. I'm in the minority on most of these. Okay, Catherine, what dumb things did you do after your scan? Well, I guess we're about to find out. Whatever this means, I don't know. Prep arc with signal transmitter. Power packs, tools, FST kit, extra oxygen, Pathos 2 permission. Put on the neoprene undersuit and body harness. Check the HPS for any visual damages. Starting with the legs, fix the parts onto your harness and work yourself upwards. Lock all the pieces together as you go. Let a partner help you with the back piece and the torso. Tap the secure button on your arm piece. You should hear the suit seal itself. The suit will then start to equalize pressure and tap into the oxygen tank. If the suit doesn't seal itself, flex the shock absorbers and try again. If it still won't work, do not try to fix it yourself. Contact maintenance. Note, the HPSs are very heavy and the suit will compensate. You will effectively be stronger than you think you are. Be careful. Regular training applies. Don't hold your breath. Don't stay out too long. Don't dive too deep. Don't dive with malfunctioning equipment. Aimatsu power suit. 
proper usage. Wow, that's so cool. It's the whole gang. A crew photo? Really? Who are you saving this for? The world was dead. Thanks, Simon. I thought being an asshole wasn't invented until the 22nd century. Now I know better. Well, also, I had a mod. The earth doesn't even look that bulky. This is going to be easy. You haven't heard of the concept of jinxing, have you? Sorry, I forgot your people were superstitious. <laughs> What's this thing? That's just a contract example. Cross reuses it to investigate structural integrity and payload frameworks. Of course. Did you get inside it? I knew what you were made of. It would be <laughs> Why is the interface in here? Can you reach the on switch? That doesn't make sense. Should I be worried about radiation? I think we're beyond that. Interesting. You seem to be one with the diving suit you're wearing. Everything's meshed together. How's that going to work with the suit we're picking up at Omicron? Um, I think they're bigger. You should be able to wear them both. Imogen? Who's that? It looks like the basis for your body is one of my old colleagues. A standard cortex chip for robots, including the data reader and the ocu torch, has just been forced through the skull. What? Structure gel has fused the whole construction together. Amazing stuff. No, 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 no. Hold on. Back up. I'm one of your old colleagues? Well, your body is. Imogen Reed. That's disgusting. Hey, don't say I'm that. I'm a lady. She was nice to me. Anyway, the Cortex chip is good news. That means we can transfer your mind to the Ark with a pilot seat. Kath, I'm half a dead person. Yes, it makes sense. Think about it. All <laughs> those simplistic minds we've run into? Just reviving a dead person doesn't seem to work that well. A robot body seems to make people a bit unreliable. You are the best of both worlds. A sound mind and a sound body. At least we know how to get on the arm. Sort of. I understand the concept, but I don't know the specifics. I really wish we could figure out how the scan data is formulated and processed. No device connected. Got it. Twelve hundred and thirty one terabytes. Approximately memory corrupted, simulation reconfiguration necessary. Uh do you want me to do this? I can't do any of it. I'm doing all of it, I guess. Should I have not done what I just did?
Is this a puzzle or am I stupid? Okay. Sim base required. Type Soma. I can't get rid of that. All right. Soma. Okay. SCN forest required. System generator. Vegetation advanced? Need a light source or water interface cam. Okay, so these are... If I do this... Okay, so if I just go moon, full moon, I don't have to load the heat mod, so maybe that's what I'm after here. Moon full required physics fluid. Physics rigid physics. Whew. Nailed it. Try loading a dummy scan. <laughs> Shouldn't be that difficult. <gasps> oh. I just want to make sure I understand how the scan data is formulated before we start messing around with the real arc. Run the simulation and then hit pause while the code is running. It'll give me a cross-section of the process. You need to pause while the dummy is loaded, otherwise I can't know if it's working or not. Uh, what? No, try again. The dummy needs to be loaded when you pause. Yes, of course. So precise. <laughs> I wish this was real. Nothing like admiring. <laughs> Being able to control the load speed. Done here? Can we go to Omicron and get my new suit now? Yeah, we should get going. Want to bring this arc as a backup? No, that wouldn't work. This is just a prototype. Good. I prefer to travel light. Let's go. Don't forget to take me with you. Okay, but what are we supposed to be putting on this thing? Nothing, right? Uh, hate it here. Hello? No, what is, oh, okay. That's fine. I'm used to getting scanned. That's what started this flipping nightmare. Oh, why is the room shaped like this? Mm-hmm. 
Okay. So. <laughs> yeah, sorry guys. I'm crouching. That's what's gonna happen. I always... The big problem that I have is that... <laughs> wow, this game suddenly feels like the bunker. And I do like... Just walk over here. Who did that? Sector RD4. RD4? Yeah, we're safe for now. But you need to get moving. They're gonna figure out where we are and come for us. Don't worry about it. The stairs are blocked and I killed the elevator. Pull the connector chip from the lock. Why? That means you're stuck as well. Only way to keep you guys safe. Take the shuttle, go to Omicron. God damn it, Juan. You just had to be a hero, you bastard. Good luck, sir. Tell Alice I love her. Ooh. Alright, so what's the deal with this? Security area. Area? Security. Se security error. Insert connector chip. God dang. I struggle with any, anything English. Why do I feel like I'm gonna be spending a lot of time running around through here? Hiding in different rooms from whatever that thing is. Oh, that's. Oh my god. This is the bunker. There's not a vent shaft in here, is there? is is walking around through the halls i just wanted to look at this sarah how the hell are we going to make sure the ark makes it every launch is a crapshoot you know that i just wish these numbers look better what do you care it's just a pack of data right yeah, just a pack of data. What is that down there? Okay, that looks like a way for me to heal. Cool. I don't I don't really want to go over there right now. It broke up in this wall. So we're gonna We're not safe in here. Don't Don't go thinking that we are. Oh. But what is propulse knee efficiency? That's not supposed to say propulsion. Wah. Quantum. Quantum something. And whatever that is. Blade Runner? That's Blade Runner. And then this is quantum something else. <laughs> Just weird pictures. Cool. Okay. Ugh, gross. Um. 
Is that person alive? I mean, kind of. can't open doors can it does it matter why is it making like burn noises i'm gonna need you to be real quiet so can you keep the wheezing down oh excuse me i gotta go back to the corner I'm just gonna check some emails. It can't open doors, can it? One of the worst cases I've seen, it's most likely his own fault. He blinded himself and clogged up his insides with structure gel. I'd be surprised if he ever woke up from the coma. It make me think of Hart's absurd story about what happened at Lambda. Could it really be that the WoW is somehow able to change and rebuild the hu Hart appears to be in good shape considering the circumstances only bruises and mild hypothermia caused by the long walk. It's difficult to corroborate her story as she is the only one to return. As usual, as usual, Chun is quiet and does her best to avoid eye contact. She doesn't want to be here, but Strohmeyer demands another evaluation. Chun isn't obstinate or dishonest, but she'd rather not speak if it can be avoided. She has a hard time dealing with people in general, including doctors. Catherine Chun is weak in character, the perfect victim to be domineered and pushed around by others. She's a scared mouse I don't want to upset, so we sit quiet and pass the time. Conrad is dead. He boiled his brain to a pulp with a W-rim maser following the ARC neuroscan. Clearly another continuity enthusiast offing himself to take his place on the ARC. Good Lord. Terry Akers, Chief Factor at Delta, first assessment. Brought in today, January 16th, 2104. Reportedly found in his diaper suit, unconscious, the water. Akers has clearly been consuming large amounts of structure gel for weeks, probably. It's Oh god. Okay, guys, I hate to do this, especially since we didn't really end on like a particularly intense part, but I do have to end the stream. Um, well, don't like that happening right now why i guess we can go no shoot 
Wish I hadn't kicked that. Oh, this seems like a safe room to be in right now. Wait, is this a vent? I don't... I... Okay. We will definitely be continuing this next Saturday. I really appreciate you guys hanging out. I love this game. It's... Perfect amount of science fiction and cosmic horror and... Just, you know, horror in general. I will see you guys next time.